hello guys welcome back to coding cafe so now in this video tutorial we will work to display the total number of friends which a user have that is let's say Mohammed Ali Sher is now uh, the online user who is logging through his account so he has the right to see how much friends he has the total number of friends and also we will display the total number of posts or you can say the status updated by this user whose name is Mohammed Ali share so yeah let's start work on that so you will simply click here and you can see when we go to the profile then this is the profile of an online user so basically we will now display I mean we will uh, add two buttons here one is uh, for the post and other one is for the uh, total number of friends so on these buttons we will uh, display the total number of posts and total number of friends and also when a user click on friends then we will send him to the friends activity and if a user click on the total number of uh, post button then a user will be able to see that how much post he updated I hope you understand this so first of all we have to add the two buttons and to uh, display the total number of posts and also the display the total number of friends so let's start work on that so for that what we're gonna do we can simply go to the the profile activity which is our this profile activity click on that and this is our profile activity and we have uh, activity profile.xml so as you can see that this is our uh, profile activity now I will simply go to the text and here uh, we are going to add buttons so scroll down and here after this uh, text view at the end here we can say button width should be 170 dp and height should be a wrap content align pattern bottom to not this one this is something else a l i g n align parent bottom which is this one layout align parent bottom to true and after this you can say align parent start to true margin from the start should be uh, 20 dp margin from the top should be 50 dp now let's assign id to this button so the id for this will be my underscore post button as the user when click on this button then we will uh, send him to the activity which we will create now where we will display only the post updated by an online user that is let's say I am an online user so how much post I updated we will display a total number of posts and also when a user click on that button then we will display those posts let's assign uh, you can see this okay this is the button now let's assign some text to this button so the text for this will be my posts or instead of that we can call it as posts and let's move it below the relationship status so what we're going to do here we can simply write below layout below you can see that and copy the id of this text view which is the relationship status copy this and pass that here and you can see that it is moved below here now let's assign some beautiful colors to this so background for this will be Android background light text size uh, should be 16 SP and let's do not for this button let's change the color to the color primary color primary dark this will look amazing okay now let's give it uh, text color so the text color for this will be background light so we can say Android and you can see right back and you can see this background light and now if I scroll down you can see that it looks perfect and style should be sorry not this text s t y which is this one text style it should be bold 
now if we see this then it looks amazing and now after this we are going to create another button to display the total number of friends so you can simply copy this uh, code which is for the button and the my post button and we will change it for the friends so first of all change the id of this to my friends button and all the things will be same now we have to make the text for this to friends so this will be friends and remove this align parent start and instead of that we can say e n okay align a l i g n align parent end to true and you can see this okay Re change this margin start to margin from the end 20 dp if i show you then you can see that so now you can see that these are our buttons post and friends and let's for now let's call it as a number of friends and here we can say number of posts so yeah that's it and now let's go back to the profile activity.java file and let's uh, here we can say private button and the first button is for the displaying total number of posts so we can call it as my posts my number let's call it as my posts and the second one will be my friends so you can give it a, any name you want but i give this name okay a simple name and now here after inside this one create method here we can say my friends equals to button point view by the dot my friends button and copy this and we will change it for the my post where we will display the total number of posts of course so here we can say my post and let's change the id for this to my post button so here we can after this here we can say my friends dot set on click listener new on click listener and inside this we can if the user click on this button then we will send the user to the friends activity so for this uh, i will just go to the main activity and we will uh, copy the code for sending the user to friends activity send user to friend activity so copy this whole method from here control c and let's come here and we will test that here at the end which is the send user to friends activity and make sure to change this to profile activity profile activity and we are sending the user to the friends activity if the user click on this uh, my friends button so here we can simply call this method which is send user to friends activity and also let's create a new activity for displaying the post that how much post a user uh, how i mean as you know that we will display the total number of posts and total number of friends also in the next video tutorial in this video we just create these two buttons which is the my post and my friends button so in this way in, in this video tutorial we will just send the user to the friends activity and to the post activity for user click on the my post button and in the next video we will also display the total number of friends and total number of uh, posts so for that we are going to create a new method uh, a new uh, activity so here we can say empty activity and the name of our this activity will be uh, my post activity 
so we will display all the post of a user who is online I mean who is logged into his account we will display all the post of him or her okay so yeah let's wait for it the gradle build running now so right, activity is created successfully which is the my post activity for now let's close this this is basically an empty activity so now what we're gonna do first of all uh, let's copy this and we will change it for the my post activity so paste that here and change this send uh, user to my post activity and instead of this friend activity we can say my post activity and now let's come here and we can copy this and we can set click listener for the my post button so here change this my friends to my post dot set on click listener and change this to send user to uh, my post activity so yeah that's all now let's run the app to see if it is working or not so you can see that our app is running now successfully and now let's go to the profile and here you can see that okay where the first button is for the number of posts and number of friends so if I click on the number of friends button then it sends us to the friends activity and it's as you know that it display the total number the friends list that is to whom we are friends and if you go back then this is the total number of first button as I told you we will display the total number of friends and total number of posts in the next video tutorial in this tutorial we just add these two buttons and we set a click listener on that so if I click on this button then it send us to the number of posts and uh, the post activity which is the my post activity and in which or uh, we will work in the upcoming video tutorials where we will display all the posts from an online user or you can say a user who is online he can see his post that whom uh, which post belongs to him and uh, yeah we will work on that in the upcoming video tutorials so yeah that's it for this video and if anyone is new to our channel then please subscribe our channel thumbs up for this video and see you guys in the next video bye for now